Changing the battery. There's a battery indicator at the top of the device here which is showing empty. When that occurs, the device makes a sound which means there's a message down here and the message will say change battery. So to stop the alarm, you press the OK button or the yellow button, it doesn't matter. And uh, we're now going to change the battery. To do so is very simple, it takes a few moments. You don't disconnect from the patients if you're already connected. Uh, you simply lift the device and turn it over and there is a little flap here, you move to the side, press the button and drop the battery into your hand. The device is still operating as you can see. Now you take a new battery and here's a new battery and we're going to insert it and it doesn't matter which way around it is as long as it's electrodes first. So we pop that in and close the door, move the flap there. There's no more buttons to press and you can see that the device continues. Just to be aware that some batteries have a black cap on which needs to be removed and some batteries come wrapped in cellophane and the cellophane has to be removed. In total, you have at least 30 seconds to change the battery, but most people can change it within about 10 seconds.